just getting ready to go for supper there that night and we'd bought a couple of tickets in Dunmore that day and so checked the one and it was a two dollar winner and you know the usual and checked the other one and it says hey it appears to be a winner <laughs> like 70 million dollar winner and just sat there stunned for a while and didn't know what to do so I quickly took a screenshot of it and then went and told Christy and figured out if it was real or not and, <laughs> and what to do and then basically just sat there for the rest of the weekend with your, in a fog basically is what you do like you think it's going to be real simple but all of a sudden your head's just full of thoughts and not knowing what to do or how to feel so you know, what do you do for work? in the trucking business and stuff so uh, not particularly, no. <laughs> no, it's going to be an early exit from that, yes. Been, been doing that for 28 years, so it's definitely time to get out of that, I guess. Like, disbelief, obviously, but I could tell right away that Dale wasn't kidding just by the look on his face and his reaction, and, and then it's just kind of a blur. You just sort of, you know, like, what do we do? What are we, like, just everything. Like, I don't know, we were... It's like sign the ticket and then we told the kids and yeah, I don't know, you just kind of go through the motions for a while and, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Just kind of in shock for a long time so and still are. So. We've got some little things and stuff that we want to do but no big plans. We've, um, we're pretty fortunate anyway and so just, you know, do some things to try and enjoy life, maybe travel a bit more and, you know, help out um, our families a bit if we can. and. And uh, yeah, just sort of play it by ear, so nothing like huge planned or anything.